A killer is out on the streets tonight because an investigator made a mistake. A judge threw out the 20-year-old's confession to killing a Valencia County man because a detective didn't properly read him his Miranda rights. And that led to reduced charges and probation. News 13's Maria Medina met with the victim's stunned and angry family. Maria? Well, Diane, the Valencia County Sheriff admits his detective made a costly mistake. There was a man on trial, on trial for second-degree murder, and... He walked free. Remigio Salceda feels helpless. Nothing, nothing can ever be done to get him back. He will never get to see his uncle Jose Salceda again. And his daughter will never get to meet him. He was the type of man that would give you the shirt off his back. Last December, investigators found Salceda brutally beaten in Jacob Sanchez's front yard near Berlin. The two men had fought. To this day, Salceda doesn't know why his 51-year-old uncle was killed. It could have been over drugs. It could have been over alcohol. But he says there was comfort knowing investigators made an arrest. Little did he know, a detective made a mistake that would cost prosecutors their case. We'll make mistakes. Sheriff Rene Rivera admits the detective who read Sanchez's Miranda rights failed to tell him he had a right to an attorney and that one could be appointed to him. The judge had to toss out Sanchez's confession. Prosecutors were forced to take a plea bargain. Sanchez pleaded guilty to involuntary manslaughter and got 18 months of probation. What was your reaction? It, um, I was pretty upset, pretty angry. What do you say to the family? Well, the, the only thing I can say to the family is, you know, I apologize. Well, I would say thank you for your apology, um, but it doesn't change the fact that there's a murderer walking loose on the streets. Now, the sheriff says he doesn't know yet if he'll discipline the investigator because he's still trying to figure out what exactly happened that night, but that he will tell investigators to read the Miranda rights just to be safe. Back to you. All right, thank you, Maria. Now, if Sanchez had been convicted of second-degree murder, he faced 18 years in prison.